things are getting weird in my apartment at the moment. I feel like there is a spirit around. I honestly don't think it helps me look like a doctor because it's really strange and you can't really wear it. Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel and happy Friday. I've just had my personal training session for the week and I'm in desperate need of a coffee. I worked so hard today, so I'm actually heading out to Nine Yards in South Melbourne for a bit of a coffee catch up with mum and then we're going to go for a wander around the South Melbourne market. So I thought this was the perfect spot to start the video. I haven't yet filmed a vlog in 2021, so welcome back. It's so good to be back speaking to the camera again. I've missed you guys and thank you for all of your messages and reaching out, asking where I've been. I've been all good. I just took a bit of a break from YouTube in January, but I'm back and I'm here to stay. So leave a comment below and let me know what you want to see more of on this channel in 2021. Anyway, without further ado, let's get this video started. It's now 8 p.m. and I thought I would fill you guys in on a bit of a supernatural story. Honestly, I don't know where to start, but things are getting weird in my apartment at the moment. I feel like there is a spirit around. If you believe in that, if you don't, you know, take this with a grain of salt. But basically, there have been two occasions that have left me baffled recently. That's why I've literally got my crystals, two crystals over here, because this kitchen space is something's going on. So got my black tourmaline to protect the energy in my apartment. But let me fill you in on what has happened and I would love your feedback. Like, let me know, give me some logical explanations so that I can sleep at night, seriously. <laughs> so the first time I got home after a day at my co-working space in the city and I walk in and the fan behind me, the cooking fan, the overhead fan, was pulled out, the light was on, and it was on. You know, it was making its noise and doing its job fanning, but I didn't turn it on. Like, I was out all day and I never leave it on. Like, it would be so obvious for me to see because it's, you know, a part of my apartment where I walk past in order to leave. Like, the door is just over there. So, that was very strange and I really did think, okay, something is not right, this is weird, but I kind of got over it. The second time was on Thursday. I went out to get my hair done, came back to my apartment, the fan wasn't on, I got changed and then I went to go get coffee with a friend. When I came back from getting a coffee with my friend, the fan was on again, the light was on, it was making noise and I was a bit freaked out. At first, I'm thinking, you know, maybe somebody had access to my apartment, like what's going on? So I checked over the security footage because I live in a high rise building, very secure, security cameras everywhere. You know, we have security on the premises and I was just like, you know, what is going on? But nobody entered my apartment other than me. So it really didn't make sense. I don't know what the explanation is. I even Googled about the Miele, you know, fan just to make sure that maybe it wasn't like, you know, a fault or something. But I've lived in this apartment since 2015 and this has never happened before. So I don't know what's going on. I feel like there may be a spirit in my apartment. It could be a spirit that I know. Like, I feel like it's a good spirit if you believe in that kind of stuff. But so so strange i would love to hear from you guys give me some logical explanations of why this could be happening but for now i have my crystals in the kitchen because something's going on over here i swear something is going on so that's what i wanted to fill you guys in on leave a comment below let me know if you've had any similar experiences or if you can give me a logical explanation i need one this is how it has been when I've walked into my apartment and as you can see it's actually extended out. It's so strange. I honestly have no idea how it could happen. Hi Frenchie fam, we're just here at the Kettle Black. Got my arm and latte and we're just catching up for a hopefully it'll be a better 2021. It's around 
12 p.m. and I'm heading off to South Melbourne with mum. We're going for a bit of a walk around just to get out of the apartment. It was very rainy this morning, so I feel like now is a good time to just go for a bit of a walk around. I caught up with my friend Thomas for brunch this morning. As you guys would have seen, we went to Kettle Black, which is in South Melbourne. Highly recommend adding that to your list. It's so Instagram worthy and the food was amazing. And then tonight I'm going to a fun party. My friend Ash just graduated and is becoming a nurse. So she's having a health themed party. I'm dressing up as a doctor So I'll show you my outfit later on to be honest I've just got like a stethoscope and I'm wearing a kind of like doctor inspired outfit keeping it pretty simple and casual But I'm really looking forward to that as well I've got my dodgy stethoscope from the costume shop that I honestly don't think it helps me look like a doctor because it's really strange and you can't really wear it, but I've also got my doctor inspired outfit on from Forever New. It's time for me to head off for the night and catch up with my friends. I'll speak to you guys in the morning. Good morning everyone and happy Sunday fun day. I had a really good time at the party last night. We're here now, it's Sunday, it's around 10 a.m. and I'm about to go and grab a coffee, but it's raining outside. It's been a bit of a gloomy day, but I'm not complaining because I know that for a lot of you guys, you're in lockdown at the moment. And my heart really goes out to all of you guys sending lots of love your way. The Frenchie fam is always here for you as well. So I really hope these videos can help you through some a difficult time too. Now speaking of Frenchie, I'm wearing my Frenchie sweater which you can still purchase at Frenchie by ChelseaElizabeth.com forward slash shop. You can get them in various sizes. I'm wearing mine in an extra small and I find it quite comfy and cozy and perfect for a day like today. You know I wear mine often in the evenings as well but you can dress them up too. You can either wear it you know with your active wear or just with your tracksuit or with jeans and sneakers or flats like I am today. Anyway, it's definitely coffee time. I will check back in with you guys soon. show you guys what I bought from Kiki K today because I hadn't been there in so long and it was good to be back. They have so many cute things, including some gorgeous Valentine's Day cards. So if you need one, go there for sure. But I bought myself this weekly planner because I really like having a hard copy planner. I use Google Calendar for Frenchie and for my personal life. And then what I do each Sunday afternoon or evening is I go through my calendar and I put everything onto my weekly planner so I can visually see the week ahead and I can cross things off as I go. It's very satisfying like crossing things off or ticking things off. So this is the weekly overview and I feel like it's a very spacious one. I love how simplified it is because this is all I need. I just need, you know, each day all mapped out and then a bit of a, you know, scribble pad in this corner here so that I can just, you know, put any reminders or any notes to consider for the following week there. So I'm really happy with this 
purchase and that's all I bought really. There was so many cute things there like I said but I really held back and tried to control myself but I wanted to leave this video here. Thank you guys so much for watching this vlog. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did don't forget to give it a big thumbs up and to click that subscribe button. It's so good to be back on YouTube and I would love to hear from you guys what you want to see more of on this channel. Do you want weekly vlogs? Do you want weekend videos? Whatever it is leave a comment down below and thank you so much for your support i am back for 2021 so i'll be seeing you in a brand new video next week bye for now